Hello guys and welcome back to another video. Today Tunbridge Angels are our way to Oxford City in the National League South. So yeah, really looking forward to this game. Um, it's probably one of our very our most toughest games left of the season. We've got in our last six games, Oxford are third and we're tenth. Um, you know, we're still only like one or two points behind the playoffs, but um, still quite a few positions off. It's very, very tight up there. Um, you know, every Tuesday results don't go away when we're not kicking a ball. But anyway, uh, let's hope we win. Uh, we drew 2-2 two -two against them at Longmead in October with Ruben Suarez Jr. and Jeremy Santos both scoring absolute worldies from outside the box. Uh, my prediction is going to be 3-1 to Oxford. I think they're going to be a bit too strong for us, but hopefully I'll get proved wrong and I'll see you inside Port Place Farm. I hate it at London if I need a game with it, absolutely. Alright, what do you mean? That's what I'd do, so I'd go. Go on, Joe! Come on, Joe Bray! Go on, Joe! Go on, Joe! Go on! Go on! Oh. Luckily, because I'm still a child. Go on. Go on, oh. Oh. Hit it, come on. Hit it, hit it. Shoot, shoot. Oh. Go on. 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 Oh! It's 1 0 to Oxford. A um, very poor goal to concede, but yeah, they had a 1 1 in score. 1 0. Oh, oh, what a oh, save. Where's Julian? Oh, fuck. Oh! oh. oh. It's 2 0 to Oxford, a header from across, and yeah, we've been absolutely terrible this whole game. 2 0. Go on. Go on, Terry. Go on. Go on. Go on. Go on, make it run. Have a shot then. Oh. So he had seven points at Christmas. It was always looked like Billericke until like the last two months. Go on, switch the play. Switch the fucking play. How long? Play with the thing. Go on, overlap. Overlap. It leads. Go on. Oh. 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 Come on. Oh. Oh. Right, come on. Oh, that was good. Next time here at Fort Place Farm, it's currently Oxford City 2, Tunbridge Angels 0, and um, yeah, I don't know what to say about that. I think Oxford has been all over us, really. Um, you know, look absolutely miles better. Um, we're very lucky it's only 2 0, really. We've not done anything. We've had actually quite a few good chances, but not done anything at all. Um, but yeah, it, it, if this continues, it could be really embarrassing like last season and the year before. Last season we lost 5 0, the year before we lost 4 0, so yeah, we always get thrashed here. But anyway, see you second half. Oh, fuck's sake. Oh! 3-0 Oxford, I just can't believe how bad we're playing right now. 3-0. Oh, oh, what? It's 
4 0 Oxford. What is going on? We've been playing so awful this whole game. 4 0. First time we can see the four scenes. <laughs> yeah. Come on! Oh! Shoot. <laughs> Come on! Oh! Oh, oh my god! Oh, my god. Oh, is that? Oh, oh my god! Woody! Oh. Oh, Joe! Oh my Good save. Full time, Oxford City 4, Tunbridge Angels nil. Speak in a second. Full time at Court Place Farm, it finished Oxford City 4, Tunbridge Angels nil. And um, yeah, I'm obviously very disappointed to come all this way to lose 4 nil. But um, yeah, so it was. I just have to say that Oxford were just better than us and they were absolutely brilliant. Um, we weren't great and I don't know where you draw the line but I think it was more of how good Oxford were than uh, the other way round if you see what I mean. Um, but yeah, uh, we've got five games left now, five massive games now. There's no more room for error against Hemel Hempstead, uh, Farnborough, Dartford, Chippenham and Chesson. So, you know, we're still only a point off playoffs but it is still unlikely, but we'll keep on going until it, it, it is impossible. But yeah, I just think Oxford were just better than us today. Deserve the three points. And to be honest with you, I think they're the team I'm predicting to win the playoffs, um, really. I think, they'll, I think they'll go up, which will overcomplicate things even more with the restructuring of the league should uh, Yeovil and Torquay get relegated. But anyway... Um, yeah, well, it wasn't really good enough today. So don't forget to like, subscribe, and I'll see you all next time. Bye.